Hey guys, welcome to my channel and today I'm going to show you guys how me and this little guy are going to whip up some homemade chicken feed for our baby chicks. Now, um, the big chicks, the big chickens are roaming around eating and, and um, we threw some grain out to them because they will eat everything. They will eat the pig food, they eat the dog food. And that's actually what we're going to mix today. We're going to mix up a mixture of some corn and some dog food. We're going to grind it up and we're going to go feed these baby chicks. So I thought I would stop and make a video. Now I'm hot and sweaty uh, because I've been mowing. And I've got some yard clippings that I want to feed the pigs. So I'll show you guys that too. But I thought this would make a good little video for any of you that uh, happen to maybe run out. And you can't just go to the store immediately and get what you need for your livestock so it's about time for us to feed this evening so we're going to show you guys how we grind <laughs> down some chicken feed okay guys so i've got to feed the pigs these lawn clippings first because if i go in there and i start shaking around that barrel they're gonna have a fit on me so i'm gonna dump this these lawn clippings over to them so that i can go and get feed to grind for the chicks there you go i got more to come more is on this way just for now that's all i raked up i'll rake up some more maybe when it cools down a bit <laughs> so here is our barrel that we keep the dog food in um, and the animals are coming, so I'm going to have to throw them some, or they're just not going to leave me alone. These chickens won't leave me alone. <laughs> so, I'm going to scoop a little bit. I'm going to get some corn, and I'm going to get some dog food, and I'm going to scoop it in this. And I'm going to take this inside. Uh-oh, y'all hear them? They know that sound. Okay, seriously, this is what I use. Uh, me and Jonathan use this little ninja, this little bullet ninja, and I just put some in here, and I just grind it up, and I'm going to grind, because we had to do this this morning, so I'm going to grind some up for in the morning, I'm going to put it in this jar right here, um, so that I don't have to wake up the house in the morning grinding chick feed. Let's just put this in. That's right. He's trying to tell you guys how to do it. So he's right. All we're going to do now is put this lid on and grind it. So I did just about a little over half, maybe half. Um, that's probably the most, the most, because this corn is really hard on my blades. Um, that's why I really need to go get some actual chick feed. Put it in there and we twist it. You have to twist it, remember? You twist it. No, you turn it this way. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. No, you have to. Remember, I showed you. He wants to do it, but Grammy's probably gonna have to do it. <laughs> there it is, guys. It's just ground up, and they really liked it this morning. Oh, I made a mess. They really liked it this morning, but I didn't. Um, this morning, I didn't do it as choppy. I did it more fine than this. Um, but I think that, <laughs> I think it'll be okay. So I just made another little batch and I really think they're going to love it because it's going to have that dog food in there and they really like that dog food and probably already spoiling the baby chicks, but why not, right? They're going to produce for us later. <laughs> Jonathan's got the water. I put some apple cider vinegar in that. Chloe. Little Miss Chloe has got the feed. And here's the chicks. And they're going to try to fly out on this. So I have to open this top cage, this top part of the cage, because they will try to fly. So what we're going to have to do, see? What we're going to have to do, sis, is you're going to have to try to give them that food and then grab their water and then shut this, okay? So you oh. dump the food in there? Don't let that get you. I'm going to squish it. Um, no, you're going to drop the food. Just don't be afraid of it. But, here. I'm going to try to open this. Keep them back. You're going to have to get in there with me. And you're going to have to pour it in their little thing or around it or something because they will attack. <laughs> yeah. Just Here's... pour it all over there. Yeah. And then grab their water. Thank uh, you. I'm stuck. And the dogs. 
water in there. And you see his socks? He got his shoes wet <laughs> from when you guys were in the water hose a while ago. Good job, kiddo. I love it when he comes to help Grammy. His sister went home. She missed mommy, so he's going to spend the night again. So he likes to help around the place. It's good for him. Okay. Same process as before. When you get in there, just tip it over. And the water will start to come out. Oops, I locked it. Okay. See, they're occupied. So, <laughs> good job. And just like that, guys, we have chick feed. So, that wasn't hard, but it's not something that I want to do every day. I don't want to grind their food up every day. <laughs> but when you're in a tight spot, and it happens, you can make your own. If you have some grain or you know some dog food, some cat food or whatever, um, just grind it up together. It's a good little treat for them, but I do want to get them chick feed because it has all the stuff that they need uh, as they grow. So... I hope this helped somebody or I hope that it blessed you in, in some way um, and I want to say thanks for watching um, and have an amazing day.